everyone. My name is Pavlina and I'm your English teacher today. I think that learning language is not only about words translation and grammar rules, it is also about culture of the language's motherland. So, what is the best way to learn something about country's culture? Yes, it's to get to know about its holidays, because they tell us about history, religion, traditions and so on. So, our topic today is Spring Holidays in Great Britain. But first of all, click the pause and look through some words that can be unknown for you. I want to start with Easter, as we also celebrate this holiday. The date of this Christian holiday is various for every year and can be on any Sunday from the 22nd of March to the 25th of April. Easter has its own symbols and traditions of celebrating. First of all, it's Easter eggs, just like we have. Eggs are a symbol of spring and new life. People decorate them with bright colors, made them from chocolate, exchange eggs and searching for them. Searching for eggs is closely connected with another Easter symbol and tradition. Many children believe that the Easter bunny or rabbit come to the house to hide eggs, so Easter egg hunt, when children try to find hidden eggs, is the traditional game on Easter Sunday. There are some other traditional Easter games. For example, there are competitions to see who can collect the most eggs or egg rolling, when hard-boiled eggs are rolled down the slope to see whose egg goes furthest. The Friday before Easter, called Good Friday, and the Monday after it, called Easter Monday, are both bank holidays. It is traditional for British to eat hot cross buns on Good Friday. These are small buns with candied fruits and a white cross on them, which symbolizes the cross on which Jesus died. Easter Monday is a day when people traditionally visit distant relatives or friends or just enjoy spring weather in the parks or work in their gardens. In some places, for example in London, there are Easter bonnet parrots, when people demonstrate their Easter bonnets, decorated with flowers, ribbons and so on. About 47 days before Easter, there is a pancake day. It's also called Shroff Tuesday. Like in Easter, it's a part of Christian holidays. Pancake Day is the last opportunity to eat eggs, milk and butter before the land starts. And making pancakes is the best way to do it. British can eat pancakes with different toppings like jam or syrup, but traditionally with sugar and lemon juice. The main custom of Pancake Day is so-called pancake races, when women run holding a hot pan with pancakes and should toss a pancake at least two times. The race starts when bells ring in the church. There is also a tradition among children to go door to door and theme to get food or money. This holiday is a little bit similar to our Maslenitsa or Kalade, right? In Great Britain Mother's Day, called Mothering Sunday, is not on the same date with ours. It usually falls on the second part of March or early April, the fourth Sunday of Lent. This holiday is widespread among many countries and celebrated to honor mothers and thank them for all their love and support. Traditions of celebrating Mother's Day in Great Britain is quite similar to Belarusian. Children present handmade cards, little gifts and bouquets to their mothers. They also should make a breakfast in bed for their mothers, even if it is, it is very simple, like toast with eggs. And mothers should eat, no matter how badly burned the toast or how cold is tea. Another tradition of Mother and Sunday is to make a rich almond cake called mothering cake or simnel cake. It's a type of fruit cake with two layers of almond paste one on the top and one in the middle. 
There are also some May holidays in Great Britain. May Day is celebrated on the first Monday of May. May Day is a celebration of the coming of spring. It's an ancient holiday according to pre-Christian times. But nowadays it's more like a festival when people dance, holding ribbons, move through town with May Day thorn and organize some night time parties. The main part of May Day's festival is crowning of a May Queen, a girl who rides or walks at the front of parade for May Day celebrations and symbolizes ancient goddess Flora. Another May's holiday is Spring Bank Holiday. This holiday falls on the last Monday of May. On this day, many organizations, businesses and schools are closed. In many parts of England there are street festivals and carnivals, but for the most people it's an extra day off which they can spend on a short trip, walking in park or visit garden enjoying warm spring weather. We know that Great Britain consists of four countries – England, Scotland, Wales and Northern Ireland. Each of these countries has its own patron. Three Patrons Day are in the spring. They are St. David's Day, St. Patrick's Day and St. George's Day. All these dates are national holidays when parents and school celebrations are organized. These are bright and excellent events when national flags are all around the streets. I hope that you have enjoyed this lesson. Thank you for your attention and goodbye.